All right, it's seven. Let's crack this bad boy open. Um, oh, there we go. This tripod's been weird today. Let me switch it up. One second. It's been giving me headaches. All right, that'll work. All right, so this is our sixth. I said sixth Ravnica Allegiance box. I didn't think we'd get to this many, but we made it. They've been fun. We've had a lot of good Ravnica Allegiance boxes. So let's make this one our, uh, our best one. I think we gotta beat the foil Kaya. Actually, double Kaya, that one. So we've seen all these cards. So I'm gonna crank through these. We, uh, we got some bad storms coming in Arkansas pretty soon. So I'm gonna try to roll right through these so I don't get hit with weather and internet issues and all that jazz. So. Let's see. Haven't done a Ravnica Allegiance box in a while. All right, first one, Pestilent Spirit for black. Yeah, last thing I want to do is these thunderstorms roll in and then, you know, good old internet goes out, live stream gets cut, so I'm going to try to roll through this pretty quickly. But, all right, here we go. Tome of the Guild Pack for Colorless. Oh, hey yo. I didn't say, hold on one second. I don't have a colorless pile yet. There we go. Let me put this away. Let me put that away. Let me adjust this light. What is that bad boy? Mesmerize, wow. Ravnica Legion's coming through again. Let me get a sleeve out for that. Foil Mythic in the second pack. That's fun. Pew. Worst Foil Mythic, all right, fair enough, but any Foil Mythic to me is a win. I know it's not the Kaya we got a couple boxes ago, but still cool to see. All right, Hallowed Fountain. There you go, Barrett. That's your first one. Um, this was suggested to me. Let me move these around really quick because I, I know I'm gonna have a crazy multicolored pile. We see that still? All right. So we're gonna put those up there so we can keep count. Actually, I don't think I've ever pulled that uh, that mythic in uh, our six boxes we've done. That might be the first time I've seen it, so. Oh, shit. Ravager Worm, all right, so it's one of those weird ones. Um, it's in the description, our eBay page. Since there's more forests than mountains, this one is going to green. All right, one second. There's your burn bright. I don't know, two mythics, like four packs, jeez. Throwing me off a little bit. So the worm is going green. And if this is your first Ravnica Allegiance box with us, um, I'm gonna randomize the rares and foils on the live stream that I cut the video. There we go for Red, the Reveler. Uh, cut the video and then I do the commons and uncommons on a separate 
just normal video. It's easier to go through them all, kind of separate things, make it quicker. Otherwise, I'll be doing an hour long live stream sitting here trying to crank out these uh, multicolored cards. Because there's a lot. There we go. Growth Chamber Guardian for green. First one we'll do the live stream. So we got four slots left to the uh, Battle Bond booster box break. Oh, look at that. That's way to go, Watsy. Um, we are going to do a Dominaria, and Alto Masters is coming. Probably April. Trying to figure out when I want to do it, but it is coming. Um, I'm still messing with prices a little bit but it's gonna happen probably gonna be the only one we do the taker for white oh yeah everybody wants in on ultimate masters so um i will have prices and all that stuff when we do our neck our battle bond break on this channel and uh i'll post everything in the comments so everybody can see it and then once I post it, pre-orders are open. Because um, I know you guys are gonna want certain colors. So that's just the way I'm gonna do it. And I'll post it on the Instagram and the Facebook. So there we go, the Absolution for white or black with a drill bit. Uh, I do sell the topper separately. Um, like I said, not sure I'm pricing yet. I'll probably go off what eBay is selling them at, um, but I do open the topper on this channel. That'd be the first car we open. So, yeah, I, I can't hold on to the topper. I know you guys want it. Someone's going to want it. I just want pictures of it. How about that? All right, the Perception for blue. And the Territorial Boar for green. So in April, we're going to do... I'll probably finish up Battle Bond number two. Um, we'll do Dominaria just because that one just went out of print. And those are going to skyrocket, not skyrocket, but they're going to go up in price. Um, so we'll do one of those before they kind of jump up a little bit more. And then Ultimate Masters. And probably one more of these, uh, Ravnica Allegiance. All right, Cinder Vines for red or green. And that might be the last, depends how quick it sells, might be the last Ravnica Legions. We'll see. Might even do another Battle Bond. If, uh, the last couple slots sell pretty quick. Because Battle Bond was pretty fun. Um, I enjoyed opening it. Seems like you guys wanted it, so we did it. It's going uh, pretty steady so far. All right, Rampage of the Clans. But yeah, the big highlight, Ultimate Masters, is coming. Battlement for white. All right, so that was the first third of the box. We got two 
We get two mythics, one foil mythic. Um, we're at count for one of those. No hydro jellyfish crazy guy, $30 card. I haven't got one of those in a little bit. Ugh, thrash and threat. But yeah, last, I think the, oh, what I get, my, I think my first box topper I pulled on my first break was uh, Tarmogoy, which was crazy. Um, I can't, oh, I did a Cavern of Souls box topper, which is pretty cool. I don't remember what my third one was. I know those are the best two though. Never pulled a Lily. But there's always time for a first. There you go, Miss Carlobe. Yeah, my first two uh, Ultimate Master boxes were were very, very kind to the customers. Plus, they were freaking crazy to open. I hope in Modern Horizons, kind of. I know it's not going to be at the level of Ultimate Masters, but. Something a little, uh, a little more expensive will be a little more fun. There you go, the Verity Serve for blue. Yeah, I know in the Cavern of Souls box topper box, we ended up pulling a second, well, just a normal Cavern of Souls. So we had a double cavern, which was very cool. Um, I just can't, It's those are the first like three boxes I did. And back in November, so it's been a long time. I go theater of horror, theater of horrors for black or red. Amplifier for red with a foil frenzied crazy looking dude for red or green. All right, we're about halfway through on this pack. Well, oh, this box, sorry. Kind of slowed down on the mythics. First two to or four packs were crazy. All right, Incubation Druid for green, no foil. About to take that halftime break and fix these piles up really after this pack before they get ridiculous. And they're pretty much already there, so. Oh, come on. Dazzle. Ugh. All right, let me fix these piles up before we do the last half of the box. Oh. Uh. Bear with me one second. All right, that'll do. Tell you what, it is weird to do boxes that don't have you know, their own giant stack of multicolored cards that I have to randomize out at the end. And then it's very clean. And then you get to a Ravnica set and it's like all hell breaks loose. Oh, look at that. There we go, third mythic, Domri. That's nice. Let me put these away so I can put this in a sleeve. Third Mythic, so going to red or green. Do that one at the end. Oh, 
Let's do it. Like Come on. Stay there. Here we go. Blood Crypt. Number two. There's our land count right there. Two. Yeah, I actually pulled a lot of Domeries. I haven't played a lot of, or very much of this set, to be honest with you. And just trying to kind of grow this thing. So I'm sure I'm gonna be late to the party. I keep saying if they can bring Magic Arena to, <laughs> to my cell phone, whoop, dropping cards. Uh, I'd be game over. And then you wouldn't see me on anything else. And there we go, Warren and Warden. So up to a three mythic count. About to be on the last third of the box. Oh man. Uh, yeah, MTG duels is kind of slow. Um, I played it for a while on my my phone, and then they came out with Arena on the PC, and it. I mean. Very nice, very clean. Everything's a little quicker. Um, I'm, I know they're gonna bring it to your phones. It's a free to play game, let's be honest. They, they're gonna make some money off it. It's only a matter of time. But yeah, I did like duels because it had some older stuff in it, which is pretty fun. There we go, Gruel Spellbreaker for a red or green. I like that they had the, the origin stories for all the Planeswalkers on duels. That was pretty fun. Um, but yeah, it was just kind of clunky. That's what it felt like. And I'm a huge Hearthstone player, so going from Hearthstone, which has a lot of uh, RNG, but very quick, very fast to uh, Magic Duels was like going back to the Stone Age. So, oh, look at that, fourth mythic. Uh, there we go. Came out of nowhere. Biogenic ooze. There we go, four of them. I know they're not the top ones, but we still got a good stack over here left, so. Oh yeah, they're gonna port that to council. I would, I'm cool, I, I want to switch, and I think it'd be pretty fun to play uh, Arena on the Switch, especially on the go. Oh, here we go, Plaza of Harmony. Uh, and High Alert, that's cool looking, or white or blue. in your pile. There we go. Here we go. Guardian Project for green. Zagana for green or blue. Oh, color this is getting a little crazy. I'd like to get one more mythic because it seems like we got a couple lower tier ones. There we go. Nico the old ways for red or green. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six packs left.
<laughs> oh, look at that. That's fun. I mean, it's cool, but... Barry, so this is like the, is the worst mythic? I mean... There's our fifth mythic. Got the foil one of those in the beginning. One dollar. That sucks. Oh. What am I doing? Okay. One dollar mythic has got me all messed up now. There we go. Stopping ground. There's three. Oh shit, okay. So we got a foil mythic and a foil rare. The reveler for red. Put that in the sleeve right away. It's pretty cool. All right, four packs left. So one dollar mythic was that make the foil like three bucks? Let's say it doesn't beat our our foil Kaya. There we go, electro dominance for red. All right, three packs. Here we go, font of agonies, font of agonies, my man. Come on, let's get some good in this last two. multi-colored uh there we go the, the devil so just like come on focus just like that mythic so this one's going to black this uh two swamps compared to the one mountain so where's black there we go all right last pack 442 foil nice uh, i thought it was a little less than that you're talking about a dollar mythic I mean, it's not terror. I mean, it's it's bad, but it's not. Could be worse, I guess. On some of bulk crap there. There we go. Last one. Gutter bones and a foil locket. There we go. All right. Let me clean these up a little bit. Move these out of the way so we can randomize out the. Rares and foils. Like I said, I will cut the video and do the commons and uncommons just in a separate normal YouTube video. What I do is if there's even amount of cards um, or even amount of, let's say the same common, I'll give each uh, color one of them or two of them. And then if they're the odd numbers, I'll randomize out. That way everybody kind of Gets a little bit of everything, and then what I can't divvy up equally, that's what we randomize out. All right, almost there. Tokens. Oh, three's not bad. Move this giant stack of yeah i i hate how they do uh like why has there got to be a trash mythic <coughs> a couple in every set just make it a rare it doesn't make sense if you're gonna throw junk in there i mean
All right, let's get set up for this. Ooh. Oh, come on. Okay, now my little tripod's being a pain. I'm sorry. Everything's going bananas on me now. Things off. Why are you all being weird? All right, that'll work. So let's start with black or red. First one. Theater of Horrors. So I'm gonna hit this three times. Whoever's color is on top, that's who the card goes to on the third one. One, two, and three. Going to red. Let me move this up a little bit. There we go. Next one. Bedazzle. One, two, and three. All right, going to black. All right, let's go to white or black. All right, first one, the absolution. One, two, and three. Going to black. Next one is Carlobe. One, two, and three. Going to white. Last one for white or black. Revival and Revenge. One, two, and three. Going to white. All right, what's next? We'll save uh, the Domri for the last. We'll go white or blue. Get this one out of the way, Warrant and Warden. One, two, and three. Going to white. Next one, Foil High Alert. One, two, and three. Going to white. All right, green and blue next. We go one, two, and three. Go into blue. Last one for green or blue. Zagana. One, two, and three. Go into blue. All right, so last color combination. Make sure these are all red and green. We'll save the Domri, Domri for last. All right, first one. Cinder Vines. One, two, and three. Going to red. Let's see, Thrash and Threat. One, two, and three. Going to green. Foil. Frenzied, crazy horned guy. One, two, and three. Going to red. There's the Domri. Let's see, Grohl Spellbreaker. One, two, three. Going to green. Nikia, Nikia, Nikia. One, two, three. Yeah. We'll call it the foil horned kitty. How about that? Going to red and the Domri. Last one. Here we go. Red or green. One, two, and three. Going to red. Congrats, red. All right. I think that's it. So 
Like I said, I'm gonna cut everything, or I'll cut this video. I'm gonna do this gigantic, where are you? There's the gigantic stack. I'll do that in a separate video. Uh, thanks for everybody for uh, purchasing slots, for all the comments. Um, like I said, next month, April, Dominaria, probably one more Ravnica Allegiance, and Ultimate Masters. I'm not gonna cut it, I swear. I will not cut with a knife. Just gonna, you know, cut the video. But Ultimate Masters is coming next month. Um, and then if you guys want to do any other sets, uh, just send me a message on eBay. Let me know. So I will see you guys later for the Battle Bond. Uh, 